Welcome back. So a South Florida artist whose work you may have seen on the walls of Wynwood is finding plenty of blank space for his next masterpiece in a neighborhood in Havana. He was born here, but his family is Cuban, so he wants to bring some Miami style to the mother country. Local 10's Hatzel Vela reports exclusively from Havana. It's one block, one wall, but to these guys... It's really inspirational for me to work here. You are in San Isidro, a forgotten neighborhood in old Havana. Yeah, I've been working a little bit larger scale with more color. The instruments are a mix of spray cans and paintbrushes. Acrylic with oil, graphite. What started as a love for graffiti has turned into a life of art, now mixed with Cuban history. I'm an artist and I like to paint, I like to create. This is Ricky Mastrapa, known in Miami as Abstract. You may have seen his work in Wynwood or really anywhere in the world. Working in Cuba is different for me because my family and my lineage is from here. And American by birth, but of Cuban heritage, so he always wanted to bring his art to the island. It makes sense. After all, his great-great-grandfather was a fighter in the War of Independence from Spain. But let's talk about the now. Mastrapa has created close to 10 murals since he has been coming to Cuba in 2015. Look at this mural, almost 72 feet in size, another one of his works near the old presidential palace. So much culture, so much richness. Co-painter and artist Jose Mertz, also of Cuban heritage and a first-timer on the island. Just to physically be here is amazing because all I know this place is through story and through perception. And now through art. Two pieces of art that are part of a larger project to revitalize the neighborhood that you see behind me. Also opening up this Friday, galleries in this very same neighborhood. There's a lot of like open space and there's not a lot of buildings that are fully restored. So it kind of like lends itself to, to do projects like this. This is one of the art galleries and its owner tells us they're working with a city historian creating an arts hub in this neighborhood. Eventually, they hope you'll be able to walk and see carefully curated projects. A Wynwood of sorts, but with a Cuban flair. I'm Hatsovella, Local 10 News, Havana.